Welcome. All right. Honestly, Ringo. to think a little harder. Come on, I'm sorry. Hey! Welcome. A local university student was attacked in Shinsondo the other day. But we've reason to suspect it wasn't an ordinary assault. The student claimed she was attacked by a monster. Our client is the mediator for the Devil Seminars of Shinsondo. He's requesting a formal investigation, as much as we can provide. You can ask the client yourself for further details. He's waiting in Shinsando. Do you have any other business with me? 
Remember your duties as a summoner. To business, then. I'd like you all to investigate the assault that occurred here in Shinsan. We've confirmed repeated sightings of a certain demon here recently. It seems fair to assume that that would be our perpetrator. The victim was a university student who was shopping here at the time. Fortunately, she only suffered minor injuries. You should find her working in Karakacho. I suggest you get her personal account of the incident. Now, I need to get back to my other cases. Best of luck. Hey, are you the girl who was attacked in Shinsando? Uh-huh. Yes, I am. I was asked to investigate the incident. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Of course. Well, on that day... Oh, sorry. Just a sec. I'm gonna bring in the experts on this one. Okay, so you felt like someone was watching me while you were walking. Is that it? Right. And when I turned around, I saw a monster. What did it look like? It was very strange, and it stood on one leg. The way it shrieked and screamed was terrifying. One leg and shrieking. Anything else? Yes, it... Oh. <gasps> the... 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 Uh, you okay? The... That's it! Right there! Couldn't stand to see its prey get away, I guess. So, it came here to find her, huh? That boy. I think someone ought to teach you some matters. Stay back! I know we can win this. You don't have to tell me. It's a risk, Melody. Get lost. <laughs> what are you thinking? I got this. Let's stay cautious. Stretch. Check them out. into some kind of doll. Was that demon somehow different from the rest? Oh, um, the, the monster. It had one leg and, um, uh... Hey, it's alright. Calm down. We took care of it. 
Oh, th thank you so much. All that matters is that you're safe. Still, something's bugging me. I'll say. Not just anyone could survive an attack from something like that. So how did you get away from it? Yes, there's actually more to the story. The first time I was attacked, I was saved by a girl. She looked about my age. A girl? It happened so fast, I didn't even get a chance to ask her name. But she was wearing this big backpack, and she dropped this when she left. A wallet? Don't see those much these days. Way too easy to drop. As I'm sure our friends found out. Doesn't look like there's any cards or cash in here. It was already like that when I picked it up. Hey, is it cool if I keep this? Since I'm involved in the case, I might end up running into the owner at some point. By all means, please tell her I said thank you if you do. Anyhow, if you'll excuse me, I have to get back to work. Appreciate it. Take care, all right? Save some girl from a monster? Mm, yeah, but I couldn't kill it. Who are you supposed to be? Actually... This is my wallet. Thanks. I thought I dropped it somewhere around here. Hey, it's empty. Oh. You found it that way? <sighs> Guess it's always been empty then. But what did I do with it before? I can't really remember. Oh, whatever. Mm, I'm so hungry. I'm starved half to death. Actually, nope. All the way to death. I am straight up dying. What? She sounds exhausted. Is she okay? She said she was really hungry. That's why I brought her here. And this starving child is the one who chased off the one-legged demon? Are you a devil summoner too? I don't know. I've definitely never seen her around. Are you sure you got the right girl here? Hey. You think this table is edible? Probably with some effort, but I'd recommend the food instead. summoning business as long as I have, you get used to seeing weird things and weirder people. But that was a genuinely, profoundly disturbing amount of food. This girl eats like a demon. 
pet demons. She's like a black hole. I wanted to try this ever since I came to the city. The tapioca pancake french toast crepe cheese hot dog? That's a meal you can put a filter on. You lost me at tapioca. A uh, filter? You old timers are so out of touch. Then again, I guess that's what makes old timers old timers. You hear what she just called us three times? Oh, I heard. I have to say, though, she makes that tapioca pancake French toast crepe cheese hot dog sound pretty good. She didn't even stutter. Oh. I heard. Anyway, I think at this point you at least owe us a name. Nana, freelance devil summoner. Just got here from the countryside. So you are a summoner, then. Nice to meet you. I'm Ringo, and I'm in the same line of work. This is Arrow, Melody, and Saizo. So what brings you here? I take it you didn't come all this way for tapioca. Mm, I came here to find my dad. I haven't been able to contact him. You find him yet? No, not yet. We could give you a hand. Mm, thank you, but I'm okay. I'll do what I can first. If you're sure. I won't push it. My dad should be doing summoner work too. Thanks, lady. That was delicious. I'm out. Not only did you investigate the incident, but you eliminated the cause. Here's your reward. Please take it. And know that I may be asking for your help again sometime soon. I've had quite a few cases lately. Done in handling the Shinsondo incident. Now then, I have another job for you regarding yet another random attack. After what happened at Shinsondo, it would seem even more occurrences just like it have been popping up left and right. Many of the victims have been left unconscious and confined to the hospital until further notice. Naturally, these incidents have been brought to our attention, but we would like you to investigate the shipping district on our behalf. The job comes from the leader of the Devil Summoners there. You'll want to reach out to him for more information. Do you have any other business with me? Remember your duties as a summoner. took the job, huh? All right. Well, as far as intros go, I guess you could call me the guy in charge around here. These attacks are the talk of the town right now, and sure enough, they're happening here too. All of the victims are summoners, 
without exception. Fortunately, no one's dead, but they've all been weakened considerably. The cause is still unknown, and I suspect there's some sort of magic at play. Some of the victims are our own, too, so it's not as if I can just sit back and ride this out. <sighs> just how it goes, I guess. Anyway, I'd like you to capture the culprit behind these attacks. The most recent one apparently took place somewhere deep within the East Shipping District. Think you could take a look? I'm counting on you. our culprit? She's clearly lost control. What do we do, Ringo? We neutralize her first. Let's go. Are you... Intel on this one. Easy shot. We owe it to you. Here I come. It's a risk, Melody. Dance! You know what to do. Okay. It's probably fine. Here goes! Out of my way. Let's How about let's turn up the voltage? Did that hurt? Impressive, Millie. Okay. Eat this! How's that? Let the rebels begin. Ugh. <sighs> 
I can't eat anymore. Uh, that was awesome. Ooh, I like Hydran. They make everything, and it all tastes great. Leave it to this kid to turn a hard-boiled bar into a bistro. I honestly didn't know the guy was this much of a chef. The bartender here is a gourmet master. A gore master. We're not so bad ourselves. You're just gore misters. Well, Nana, if you're done eating, do you mind if I ask you something? What? We're investigating all those incidents lately. The attacks. And we're wondering if you're responsible for them. Hmm... Probably. Probably? My memory's all fuzzy. Fuzzy? What, are you a sleepwalker or something? <sighs> Do you have any idea why you might have attacked summoners? You guys are so annoying. I told you, I don't know. Hey, try not to piss her off. We don't want her going on a rampage. Look, Nana. Even if you don't remember, a lot of summoners might have been hurt because of you. You've got some incredible power, but that means you've also got a responsibility to control it. Well, I mean, that's... I do feel bad about it. I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt anyone. Look at that. There's a shy girl under all the quirks. Yeah, I think she's a good kid at heart. My dad was a summoner. So, I kind of thought other people in the same line of work might know something. What's your dad's name? Maybe we can help. Gen Mayumi. <sighs> What's wrong, Melody? Nana. Gen Mayumi. That is... your father. What? He's already dead. He was killed by a group called the Phantom Society. I'm one of their operatives. <laughs> he was the assistant of a scholar named Mangetsu Kuzunoha. He held something very valuable, called the Blue Covenant. What? You gotta be kidding! It's true. We killed your father in order to take the Covenant from him. Melody. <laughs> it's the truth. And it should be enough for her to give up. But... Don't lash out at Melody, Arrow. The kid was bound to find out eventually. What's more cruel? Telling the truth, or her never finding out? That's not... You didn't kill him yourself, right? <laughs> Nana, you're not going to find your father. Your journey is over. Go home. <laughs> A kid with this kind of power wandering around the city is only going to cause more problems. Wait! Nana! Don't. There's nothing you can... Nothing any of us can do now. Tch. This is just how it's gotta be.
You think we should forgive this rogue summoner just because they feel guilty? You seriously think that's gonna fly? We've got a reputation to think about here. At least, that's what I wish I could say right now. But considering you guys stopped this troublemaker when none of us could, I don't exactly have a whole lot of room to talk, do I? So long as the attacks are over and done with, then we're good. I'd call that settled. You guys did your job, after all. And on that note, here's your reward. For this job, the client is asking for your team specifically. The devil summoner in question would like your assistance investigating an abandoned building. It sounds like this mission will be quite significant for our client. If you do accept this job, then I'll invite the client here to explain the details in person. Then I'll send for her now. Ringo, I suggest you assemble your team. Thanks for taking my request. Nana! What are you doing here? I ended up crying a lot. <sighs> I thought about going back to the country, like you said. I didn't like that idea. It felt like giving up. And I don't want to give up. That's when Madame Ginkgo took me in. Even if she has no intent to attack anyone, the girl's clearly a powerful summoner. So I've been keeping an eye on her. Nana, if it's revenge you want, there's something I need to do first. But once that's done, it's fine. It's not like you killed him. I don't care about revenge anyway. I just want to know who I really am. You don't know? I've got this floaty feeling. Like I'm here, but floating. It's like I'm here, but uh, I'm not. And I forget things a lot too. Like the summoner attacks. I want to know what's wrong with me. I don't care about my past. I just want to figure out my present. And I think my dad's at the center of the truth. So, I gotta find out what he was doing. You're serious. I need your help. Okay then. Got that everyone? This is a formal job now. Yeah. You got guts, kid. We're gonna give this case everything we've got. Right, Melody? Yeah. Thanks. You seem like good people. But that's enough sappiness. I want you to take me to Mangetsu's hideout. The one in the central line of the abandoned subway. Ideally, he would search the facility where Mangetsu Kuzunoha and Gen Mayumi originally conducted their research. However... That's the place Iron Mask attacked. Yes. As such, Yatagarasu has the entire place locked down. So the plan is to go to Mangetsu's hideout instead and look for clues. Yep. I heard you guys had been there once, so it'd be cool if you guys could help me. Take a look around. Okay, then let's head out. We'll meet you at the central line of the abandoned subway. 
best of luck. And please, take care of Nana. Thanks, madam. Okay. Ringo, I'll see you there. Do you have any other business with me? I bid you good luck. Hey, we're ready now. Let's head over to Mangetsu's hideout. Yo, check out the noggin on that one. It's completely out of control. Be careful. That's no ordinary demon. It's got the same smell as the one I fought before. You mean that demon that turned into a doll when it died? Can you really tell, Nana? We'll worry about that later. Let's go, everyone! You know what to do. Okay. I won't stop you, bud. Freeze you where you stand! No more games. Still with me? We're lacking intel. Get lost! They're strong. Be on your guard. All right. How's this gonna go? Want a piece of this? They're strong. Be on yeah, your guard. Good plan. We're lacking intel. On this. Here goes. Stay cool, all right? Mega hit. Oh, whoa! What was that? Did she seriously just match Ringo's ion-enhanced summoning? I thought it might be better for me to do it this way. No reason to act surprised. It's kind of hard not to. What kind of summoner are you, Nana? Anyone get in our way. This will turn the tables. Questing backup. Pleasure is mine. I'll do it again. Have a You know what to do. Let's go. So you. Now go. Here we go. We gotta win this. Right. No matter what. That's pretty good. That's it, Melody. I'll handle it. You're wide open. We gotta win this. Oh, good it. idea. No matter what. That's it, Saito. Say so. Yeah, that was snazzy. Saito looks Fine. pretty proud of himself. Okay, great. Accessing data. Great. Cool biz. Won't miss. 
Let the rebels begin. You know the drill. Don't be a hero. Let's go with That's that. That's pretty good. Go for it, Let's Arrow! Go They're strong. Here goes. That'll work. On your guard. Up. Time for a deep freeze! Bingo! Just That's getting set up. How about this? Let's play it cool. Good night. Demon turned into a doll again, just like last time. Like Nana said, it looks as if this demon's the same as the one we fought back in Shinsando. These demons, just what are they? Here, Nana. Let's look for clues on your dad. <sighs> hey, you okay, kid? Let's just get to searching. Man, no dice on my end. We were pretty thorough the last time we investigated the place. It'll be hard to find anything we overlooked. This is it. A file. Was this here last time? I wonder how we missed it. I don't know, but I feel... drawn to it. Kinda. Drawn to it? Some kind of demonic effect? A lingering spell? It just smells like my dad. It smells? Hey, can I... Take this with me. You're the client here. Do whatever you want. <sighs> thanks, Ringo. And thanks, everyone. You guys worked really hard. So next time, let's go have some of that crazy tapioca stuff. It's on me. Uh, look, that's sweet, kid. But creaky old folks like us gotta lay off the desserts, <laughs> right? Yeah, especially crazy desserts. Wow. Pretty pathetic. More for me. I'll eat with you, Nana. I knew you were a kindred spirit, Ringo. How about you, Melody? Sure, sounds nice. Yay! Hooray! In moments like this, she almost seems normal. I'm gonna take some time to look at this file. Thanks again, everyone.
choices. But my wallet's empty. You've been pushing yourself pretty hard lately. How about you get whatever you want? My treat. Yay. Hey, I'm ready to order. Uh, for starters, I want one of everything that wasn't here last time. One of everything? Ugh, I think I'm gonna need backup. All hostels down. Perimeter secure. Did you see how much food that was? It felt like she was defying some laws of physics, but I can't figure out which ones. Why am I even here? I'm supposed to be a phantom operative. Brunch and girl talk aren't my thing. Speaking of girl talk, are you three interested in anyone? What, like, romantically? Hmm. I wonder if we're even capable of dating. According to our spec notes, we can simulate the brain chemistry necessary for feelings of romantic love. That is, the brain can't exactly function without those chemicals, so Ion didn't have much choice. Though it's set to low priority, so we can focus on the mission. Simulate. Spec notes. So basically, if I haven't fallen madly in love yet, it's the guy's fault. Well, what about you, homegirl? What? Are you talking to me? Who taught you homegirl? Oh, Melody loves like a lady out of a Shakespearean tragedy. It's like devotion, but darker. The kind of love that drives you insane. Blood is shed and people die over it. Hardcore. Respect, homegirl. Stop saying homegirl. Whoa, did we walk in on some girl talk? Can we join the slumber party? After all that food, it may well be a slumber party. What would you do if a threat appeared and you were too sluggish to fight? Saizo seems like he'd just play around with girls' hearts. Hey, a gentleman doesn't kiss and tell. Uh-huh. Well, fine. What about you, Arrow? Do you have a special someone? No comment. Uh-huh. Uh, what? Nothing. I... Hey, what's the problem? Nana! These two, huh? Mm, yeah, that's still a no for me. Well, how about Raven for a bachelor? He's a stand-up guy, isn't he? Definitely not for me. The way he acts is so... fake. Gives me the creeps. Uh. He's not fake at all! Whoa. Well, sorry. My mistake, then. Wow. Oh! I... I see. So Fig's in love with this raven person. I... Uh, well... Huh? Wait. What's going on here, Fig? We should call him over here to hang out. Right, Arrow? He's been so busy lately. He might appreciate a chance to get off his feet. That sounds like a great idea, right, Ringo? What's got you so jittery? Uh, fine, I'll call him. <sighs> now... Where's the target? Ringo, what did you say to him? That there was a ravenous beast in Hydran. So, is it in the area or something? What up? I'm a ravenous beast. Is this 
ridiculous. I'm so sorry, Raven. Well, if we'd just given you a straightforward invitation, you'd have waved us off. Well, uh... You're here now, aren't you? Kick back, stud. Take a load off. This girl's an unfamiliar face. Who are you? I'm Nana. Just started my career as a freelance double summoner. Nice to meet you. Huh. Likewise. See, we were just talking about how figs totally... It... Well, it's not a big deal. It's just that... You're always working so hard, and I respect you a lot, and that's all. <laughs> Thanks, Fig. Uh, Nana! You should tell him the truth. We're summoners. We never know if we'll make it to tomorrow. You might regret not saying it. I really respect Raven, and that's... That's all I wanted to say. I know, Fig. Me too. The truth, huh? Um, we're not boring you, are we? Oh. Sorry if I came off that way. I guess I've been pretty tense lately. Feels like I've forgotten how to relax like this. One day this'll be your normal again. Yes. Thanks, everyone. It was nice to get a break, and I mean that. But maybe next time you can just ask me to come instead of sounding a monster alarm? Hey, Ringo. This is really nice. Everyone's got their own things going on, but... Talking about love, telling jokes... Fighting, eating tasty food. I had a lot of fun. I hope we can hang out like this again sometime. Then how about we come back when they've got something new on the menu? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>